Hey, what's up boys and girls? Welcome back to New Stuff TV, the untechnical tech channel. I'm your host, Antoine, two for one Richardson, cause today we are checking out two products in the same video from One More. All right, man, take a look. We got the One More Fit Open Earbuds S30, as well as the One More Fit Open Earbuds S50. Now one is a little bit more premium than the other, and that's why we're gonna talk about both of them because you need to know the differences and the similarities from both. Let's talk about the similarities of both because they're both really good. It's just gonna depend on which one suits your needs the best. They're both around 10 grams with a light, non-intrusive, comfortable design, and they both have Bluetooth 5.3. They both have four mics for natural sound and phone calls, and that's really important because when you're wearing open ear earbuds, you wanna hear your environment, right? So when you take a phone call, you naturally hear a lot of ambient sound because it's open, but also they need to block out all the ambient sound to your listener on the other end of that phone call and both of these earbuds do a fantastic job of that. Now moving into these S30s, they have a 14 millimeter driver with a directional design that helps with sound leakage and gives a better bass performance. And that's something I can get behind because you know I love that bass, man. All right, let's get a little deeper into these things. Right here, you see this surface where you have the logo. This is actually a touchpad. This is where you interact with the earbuds for uh, double taps and triple taps, depending on what you want to do. And they are programmable, by the way. Then you have your flexible uh, ear hook right here that wraps around the ear and then when you turn it around you see that directional design where it's pumping all that bass into your ear holes now as i put these things on my ears i want to tell you about the durability they do have an ipx5 rating which means you can do all your activities in here like cycling bicycling weightlifting, and running and sweating because they're ipx5 and they can resist that kind of stuff as far as battery life goes, you're gonna get about 10 hours on a single charge out of each earbud. And the reason why I say each earbud is because they do work independently of each other. But back to battery life, once you add the case into the mix, you're gonna increase that playtime to up to 30 hours worth of playtime. But now let's take a quick dive into the app. You can see on the homepage here, you can monitor battery life with the case and both earbuds independently. But then we can get into some custom settings here. Remember when I talked about those double taps and triple taps? Well, here's where you can actually program it. So for a double tap on the left earbud, you can choose between all these next track, previous track, turn up and down the volume, play and pause. Then you can move on to the right earbud and do the same thing or the opposite if you want to. And of course you have your triple tap, which has the same functions, but you can customize this in four different ways because you got two earbuds that do two functions. But now here comes the fun part. If you go back to the home page, then go to equalizer, you got your EQ right there. So you can play around with these things and, and just kind of fine tune them to sound like what you want to hear. Now this is something really cool that I'm glad they're putting in earbuds these days. You see at the bottom here where it says soothing sounds, just tap that and then you get into these soothing sounds, man. You got summer rain, medium fire, drizzle, was that thunderstorm, what else, breeze, got all kinds of things, man. This is super cool because now you can just have your moment. You know what I'm saying? You just wanna chill real quick and just kind of take the edge off, maybe even meditate. You can just go into this, play it real quick. And then once you feel like rejuvenated, you can go back to your day. But that's enough about the S30s. Let's get into these S. 50s man they're taking it up a notch by giving you more durability and battery life they're giving you an ipx7 rating for more durability and they're giving you 11 hours on a single charge per bud and up to 38 hours with the case now take a look at the design difference between the s30 and the s50 on the outside of the s50 you have what looks like a button it is not that is a microphone reel because you do get better calls with these but then you have this touchpad right here where the logo is you get your double taps and your triple taps and you can uh you can actually program them respectively per earbud. But this is where it gets crazy because now they're giving you the one more pure power driver. All right, now look at this. I don't wanna call this an ear tip, but it's kind of like an ear tip, but it doesn't go into your ear and clog anything up because it's an open hole right there. And then on the outside of it, you have an open hole back here. So it is true open air listening, but this is how they kind of direct the sound into your ear hole for deeper bass and better sound. And it's just, man, it's, it's, it's a really good concept because it's still open ear, but you're getting a lot better sound quality than you would with a lot of other open ear earbuds. And the cool thing is they give you a few to pick from. So if the one that comes attached to the units already is too big or small, they're giving you a few to pick from. Man, we got an extra large, then we got a medium, then we got a small, like this is super tiny, man. So if you don't want it touching your ears, you ain't gotta have it touching your ears because it's supposed to be an open ear concept, which is supposed to also mean more comfort while you're wearing them. Now with the S50s, you do get slightly more features than you do with the S30s inside of the app. So let's take a quick look at that. 
Of course, on the home page, you can monitor battery life between the case and both earbuds, but now you got smart playback, which you can go in and just have it pause as you take them out or not do anything at all. You can customize that, but then you can go into custom settings. And of course you got your, uh, your customizing your left and right earbud for double and triple taps. But now we get into low latency mode. So let's just say, you know, you're gaming or something like that, or maybe watching some content. Now you can be more responsive with your mobile gaming and you don't have to worry about the lip syncing up as you're watching your movies and stuff. But check this out, you got your equalizer, right? Now you got a bunch of presets, man. Studio, bass booster, classic, podcast, electronic, a whole bunch of them, which is something one more is really proud of because they asked me to mention this to you. These were meticulously tuned by Luca Bignardi, who's a four-time Grammy Award winner and two-time Grammy-nominated audio engineer. I don't know what that means to you as a consumer, but what it means to me is that some dude who knows a whole lot more about music and audio than I do help create the sound of these things. At the end of the day, one more cranked out two great open ear earbuds, leaving you with the ultimate dilemma of which one to pick to suit your needs the best. I don't know, man, I'm usually a pro kind of guy, so I'm gonna go ahead and rock with these S50s. Now y'all keep being good to each other and I'll see you when I see you.